user accounts in Business Central are first created in the Microsoft 365 Admin Center. And these user accounts aren't exclusive to Business Central. If you subscribe to other plans, they can be used to sign into other applications such as Power BI. Once the user has assigned a Business Central license and permissions, the user record is automatically added when they first log into BC or by using the update usage from the Microsoft 365 function from the user list. So if I go to the user list, if I go to the user list, I can go to process and update users from Microsoft 365. So once I do that, any changes that are made in, in the tenant to the, to the user's account will be updated here. And that might be permissions or access to other licenses or something along that line. <clears throat> Each user permission set User group memberships license assignments can be seen in the fact boxes and allow posting to and from can also be changed here. So if you've got a, a, several users, as most of us do, I only have one here, but if you select that user, you can see on the side all of their permission sets. You can see all the user group memberships that have been assigned to them any licenses so you can actually see what licenses are assigned and um, either uh, know if they, they need a new license or if you, they need one removed and then allow posting to and from is goes to the user setup and sets their the dates they can post information from and the date that it that um, they can post to So I can also see and set up user groups from here. So if I navigate and go to user groups, I can see all of the user groups that have been created. I can create new user groups um, and I can see the permissions for each user group here, which is only one. Um, So you can see each one of the permission sets that are assigned. You can go to the user group, be the members that are assigned to that user group, edit the list and add users. So obviously I'm the only user in the system, but you can add as many users as you want to, the, to this user group without having to go to each one of those users uh, card and add the different permission sets. So that's a time saver. It's easier for you to group different types of uh, different users and the tasks they perform. You can go to permission sets at, and add permission sets. You can go to the user settings and the user setup card from here. So user idea and, and, and see their entire setup. So we can see they allow posting and allow posting to and from here and any other areas where they're able to access. From here, you can also set up your warehouse employees. Anything to do with the User setup permissions, roles, you can set up from this, from this section here. <clears throat> 